look. This guy don't obviously want to talk about the music and he wants to get you hung up on some other shit. I'll tell you why. I, I just came up with that metaphor to get the prod going. Totally. That's all. It wasn't yeah. like you're supposed to realize that. I just thought that was a, a shortcut or a shorthand, a way yeah. of getting a proj going where you don't really, you know, what I learned from uh, Bob Marsh and uh, Jack Wright jumping from the pole. Now, after talking to you and having you on the show, I wanted to try that. And shorthand for that was three layer kit. I mean, that's as far as it went. You know, all I did was that stupid name, and that's all he cares about. <laughs> well, I, well, I think. I mean, I think. <laughs> no, he's just being cute. You know, he needs the back of the fucking hand on the <laughs> forehead, the knee uh, technique, therapy. Insofar as a situation where you can bring whatever you want. I mean, that was the most fun. I love that the most. I, I, I just listened to everything a lot, you know, before I decided what I was going to do. And, uh, you know, I like making parts, too, as much as improvising. So uh, I tried to, to, to mix both, you know, parts and improvising. And uh, it was just, uh, it was such a great uh, base to, to do that over. You, you guys, uh, there were so many things I wanted to do. And I, but I tried to, I tried to make it uh, into songs, but also have a good amount of improvising. I, I got to tell you, my motive was experimental. I was yeah. Podge as a petri dish. I wanted to put in practice what I was hearing. You know, uh, I, I do have a little bit of tradition. Minutemen would do jams mm. in, in sets. You know, you had all them little songs all worked out, but maybe three one minute parts around in the set would be no tune, just connected to Uh huh. But, you know, I was kind of scared about it and shit and didn't want to listen to it. And it was just something uh -huh. there to make it kind of tricky and like you gave it a title. You even put a title on the set list, even though it was a fucking song. Two for oh. Wink God. One of them yeah, got two released. Wink God. Is that a lie? At the time. Right. Yeah. Did you want to say anything about uh, Biza about the, in reference to Oh, the title. Yeah, Stove Top. You just thought it was the craziest idea. He wanted a name for a band. He, we were messing around with him for Biza. It, um, he just thought it was the most hilarious name because I was just thinking of something that you cook up. But it, it's kind of jive, right? It's some kind of like meatloaf filler shit just to stretch. Shepherd's pie. Uh, yeah, like uh, uh, processed carbohydrate. But I just said stove top. I was trying to think like Walt Whitman putting out leaves of grass, you know, the, uh, 1855 version of Do It Yourself. And I told him that, but thinking back on it. But then I thought, you know what? No, no wine before it's time. I think maybe if Mike's into it. Maybe we can call it. And so you sit here and. It's yeah, not. Time like 35 years. <laughs>